In today's day and age, the AI development has rapidly evolved. We can right now create actually quite good four seconds long AI videos. And also we can create consistent characters. In this video, I will show you how you can do exactly that. Now, first let's touch on the topic on how to create a consistent character. Now you can create a character or basically an AI image with a few tools. You can create AI character with Copilot. You can create a character with Leonardo.ai. You can even create a character with Adobe Firefly, ChatGPT, and many other models like mid journey or stable diffusion. But for this video, I will show you how you can create consistent character with Leonardo.ai, which I think it's a really, really great tool and it's completely free to use. Now, keep in mind that Leonardo.ai has about 150 credits, which are completely free for the daily use. But you can see here that it's resets in 15 hours. So for example, if you are creating a lot of the characters with Leonardo.ai, then I highly suggest that you guys use the link in the video description down below and if you use the yearly option to subscribe to one of the models then you will get up to 20% off so I think that 20% off by using the link in the video description below it's totally worth it and for example with a free account you only get about 150 fast tokens but if you get more premium model you will get 25,000 fast tokens resets monthly unlimited relaxed image generations once fast tokens run out up to 10 pending jobs, private generations, and so and so on. So I think that the paid model is actually worth the money. You get a lot of benefits as I mentioned them before. So let's go back to Leonardo and let me show you how I created this AI character for my thumbnail image. So this is basically the prompt and this is the fine-tuned model which I used for this image. Now here you can also pick a style, add some elements if you want to so elements are like an additions to your prompt and you can see here for example 3d sculpt dragon scales and so and so on you can play with that but i left pretty much everything as it is the most important part is that you create your images based on the content you are creating for example the video you are watching right now is in 16 by 9 aspect ratio so this is why i create images in 16 by 9 aspect ratio but for example if you are making short form content which is pretty much in vertical format then you will need to go here to the advanced controls and change this from 16 by 9 to 9 by 16 to match the resolution of the vertical format content if you don't have any inspiration for your consistent characters then i also highly recommend that you go here up to the top to leonardo.ai and on the first page you can actually go here to the character now here you will find a ton of the pre-rendered or pre-generated characters and you can basically then copy their prompt and modify it to your liking. So for example, I will go to something very, very interesting. Let's say this one right here and you can see here prompt details. You can just copy them to your clipboard and you can also see here which uh, workflow was used and in this case, photo real version two. Now with a copied prompt, you will navigate here to image generation and then you will basically put in this prompt dark elf with gold arrow then you can also add something as your preference now here you will select your fine-tuned model the one i really highly recommend is albedo base xl this one is quite nice but keep in mind that based on the fine-tuned model you will see how many of the tokens it will take to generate your image for example with albedo base xl it will take around nine tokens but with leonardo lightning xl it will only take about seven tokens so there is two tokens difference i will go with albedo i will leave everything as it is here so 16 by 9 aspect ratio and i will click on generate the image so this is our current character now you can click on it here and this is the one which i am going to use for our consistent character now here you can click on download image you can copy it to clipboard you can even remove the background or you can even upscale it but keep in mind if you want to use the upscaler then please use the link in the video description down below and upload upgrades to more or subscribe to more premium account of the leonardo.ai it doesn't cost you anything more but you get to support the channel at the end of the day now once you are happy with your 
character, you can click here on download image. Now, once you have it, you can even make it a bit better with another tool, which is called Crea.ai. Now, Crea AI is a really nice enhancer and it will make your image a bit more HD with some textures and some of the nice, really nice realistic effects. So here, once on this page, you can click on drag and drop item, click on your generated image, which you got from Leonardo.ai, link in the video description down below, by the way, and then you can click on open. Right now, the Crea AI is actually generating the prompt or extracting the prompt from this exact image. You can even upscale your image to up to eight times, but I will leave this to two times and you can even go here to the settings. So this is the actual prompt which the Korea.ai generated. You can even go here and change this to whatever preset you like, for example, digital art or to the flat sharp or anything else. I will leave it as default and you, you can even enable color correction here as well. I will leave everything as it is and click on the enhance. So this will upscale the image to two times. For example, here, this is the before, this is the image created by the Leonardo.ai, and this now is the image enhanced with the Crea.ai. And then you can click on download right here. Now let's move on to the actual video creation from the image. And for that, we are going to use the Pixverse AI. Now, once on this page, this is basically the first page here. You can see here that the, for example, the Leonardo AI uses actually the tokens, but the Pixverse AI uses lightnings. So here you can go to create on top right. Make sure that you also have account for Pixverse AI. It's completely free to use, but keep in mind that you will get the watermark on your videos if you use the free version of Pixverse. Now here, for example, you have the text. You can even enter the prompt here and create whatever here you like. I will go with the character here and here you can see that we don't have any of the characters. I will click on plus here and I will upload image, which is this one right here and hence with Crea.ai. And this is this will basically, this image will act as our character in the video created by Pixverse AI, by the way. And we can also add this one to the name. So let's add a name to, let's say, Cindy. Then we have here the type style, which is realistic, and we can click on create character. And now after you added your own character, you can see here that we have Cindy here and we can also add a prompt or negative prompt. So I will leave everything as it is. I will put the seed somewhere here and then you can click on create. And right now you can also create, basically you can see that we need to enter the prompt so we can use our character. And then we can click on create. And now let me show you how our consistent character actually looks like. So if I click on here, you can see how it looks like. I think it definitely messed up something. It actually isn't perfect because our input image is completely different from this video output here. So you can here, for example, see the aspect ratio, the style, the seed. And if you want, you can also upscale this image. This is how you can basically create consistent characters with Leonardo.ai as well as the Pixverse AI. And then if you want, you can also add some music behind your videos. And for that, I highly recommend upbeat.io. It's completely free to use. It's music for creators and it has no copyright issues. But keep in mind, for example, that if you go here for the free account only, you get about three downloads, which are renewed monthly. So keep in mind that if you are making a lot of the content, I think that only three downloads of songs won't actually cut it. So then I highly suggest you that you guys use the link in the video description below and upgrade to the premium account, which is about five euros and 60 cents per month. You will get unlimited downloads, 100 catalog access, whitelist up to three channels, premium tracks and sound effects, ad free and for individual creators and micro organizations, which I think is totally, totally worth it. And if you pay up yearly, you will see save 20%. I think it's totally worth using the link in the video description down below. It doesn't cost you anything more and you get to support the channel. So for example, you can even go here to the playlist generator, describe your video scene. This thing with, which is powered by ChatGPT will generate you a sound or the actual song 
for your video which is really really nice so that's pretty much it for the video thank you so much for watching if you guys haven't already drop a like right now down below subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and with that said have an amazing rest of your day and i will see you in the next one peace